Hey everybody, it's Dustin again with the WebEx Devices team. And on this episode of the WebEx Edge, we're gonna show you how simple and easy it is to connect your laptop to a WebEx board and enable touch redirect. So one thing to note here is that we're gonna show this on this 85 inch board I have behind me here. And uh, just note that it has to be an S version of the board. So the 85s are all 85 S versions. Um, and then on a 70 and a 55 inch board, in order for this to work, you have to have the S version of the board. So with that being said, um, just to kind of talk you through what I have set up here, I've got the board here, I've got a laptop here. I do have uh, underneath the board, uh, connected to the back of it, the HDMI cable, which is needed to send the video, as well as a USB-C to USB-A cable, uh, which will allow for the touch redirect capabilities. So both of those are run on my board, they run around the side here, and I've got both of those cables here laying next to my laptop, and I'm gonna show you how this is going to work. So to start off, I've got my cables here, and I'm gonna change my view here to where you can kind of see where I'm actually gonna plug these in. So, um, or I'm gonna add an, another camera view. So I'm plugging in my HDMI cable, and we'll give that a second. So I've got that plugged in, and one thing you'll see here is now that the laptop has detected it, it's actually gonna send the signal, this is a, a basically a clone of my laptop uh, to the uh, WebEx board, and it's showing it here um, on the board, and that just happens automatically. There's nothing special that I have to do. It's gonna detect that input, detect that source, and it's gonna show up on the board. So now that I have this, you can see I can touch the board, and all I'm doing is bringing up the menu, the board's UI here, there's no uh, touch redirect, no interaction. It requires one more cable. So let's show you that one. So this is the USB cable I talked about. And I'm gonna plug it in here. And you probably heard the little uh, detection there. So Windows actually detected this and, and now knows that it's connected. So I'm gonna go back to my regular view here so I can show you this. So now that I have this plugged in, what we're gonna see now is that when I bring up my menu, I have a new option down here. So I have my annotation option. And I now have a little touch uh, finger uh, icon, which allows me to enable the touch redirect mode. So now that I have that enabled, you'll see that I'm actually able to interact with this device, move icons around, and I'm using touch redirect to interact with my PC from the WebEx board. Now, one little tip and trick here for you is that uh, Windows has this great uh, feature called tablet mode. So I'm just gonna bring up, for example, um, the Edge browser here, and you'll notice that I have my uh, icon up here and I can select it, but I don't have any way to interact with this or, or, or text. I could go to my um, uh, laptop and start to type things in, but if I wanted to, uh, in the bottom right hand corner, I can bring up the Windows menu here and hit tablet mode. So now that I have that turned on, you'll notice that whenever I click into the address bar, it will bring up a keyboard, which will allow me to type in text. So. Pretty much that's the basics of it. Um, one thing I will say is, is that if you come down here and hit your icon again to turn this off, you now go back to regular UI and the touch redirect will be turned off. So I hope you guys found this helpful. If you have any questions, please let us know, comment below and uh, be safe out there.